carrying a lot today. My backpack with my microphone, my mat, my towel. Last year around the same time, I found myself doing the same thing. Getting ready to make myself, find myself a place, some part of sanctuary, some part. Man, that was quite a journey. I love it. I hope you guys loved it too. It was so beautiful. I'm out here by the lake. The sky was clear earlier, but right now it's, you know, you know what they do. On, on my journey here, to, you know, taking my feet off and putting it in the mud. You know, you know how it goes. The first 15 minutes, it's, it's programmed. But after half, half an hour, 45 minutes, you're just in the state of bliss. You're connected with nature itself. You're connected with Gaia in her grid. Because it truly is AI versus organic. You know, for those who took the, the jab, um, I, 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 listen. Anyways. Yeah, come on, we look at us. Let's get higher. Praise the Father in the sky. Mother Earth and the source, the heartbeat down inside. I know who I am and I'm going to tell my truth. And I promise I'm never going to tell no lies. And I just want to be me. Hands up in the sky. Fall to my knees when I go. My family see me in the sky. Dad, I know you disappointed in me. I know I'm anointed, but I don't know how to be free. These trials, tribulations, Father Man took his toll on me. All these vibrations of fear. Lost my soul identity and it held me down. And I had to break free, praying. 
talking to God. Can you please save me? Save me. The way the world is going kind of crazy. I need you right now. It seems to amaze me. And I'm standing out in the crowd praying, please, Lord God, can you save me? Care to tell the truth. Afraid to be me. But I'm standing out the crowd. And I'm going to be free. All these walls fall down. False idols before me. I come to do that will. Keep the hot vibes and bass bump. Let's get higher. Praising Father in the sky. Mother Earth and the source. The heartbeat down inside. I know who I am. And I'm going to tell my truth. And I promise I'm never going to tell no lies. And I just want to be me. Hands up in the sky. Fall to my knees when I go. My family see me in the sky. Hello, everybody. It's King Chains. And I hope y'all take care of yourself. Hope y'all get in nature. And you're out in the sun drinking water during this time of evolution. I made this time in this space. For high vibrational beings who just need to get away and can just be be what they were designed to be and that's the divinity and i wanted to post a video because i do this every year if you look at my uh, videos from last year i was doing the same exact thing um it's starting to get nice out hold on one second i get my staff <clears throat> so it's starting to get nice out so what i like to do is find locations that are very uh hidden and sacred so I can be alone with myself so I can come to myself you know what I mean because throughout the day throughout life we give a part of ourselves to things external and if you're not careful you will lose your sense of self so it's very crucial for the chosen to make time for self and make space for self that's what we do in these videos. I want to be a conduit and I want to catapult the collective consciousness because uh, a lot of us have been living in our lower function. Our higher function, our higher self isn't really us, but it's a higher version of us. And a lot of people don't know what that is, who that is or what that is. They don't know their purpose. They don't even know what brings them joy. They don't know who they are. I'm gonna explain something to you guys. Um, so you have the beast, which derives of an ego. Okay? That's this guy. This guy with the beard you're looking at. This guy with the beard has a name. This guy with a beard has joys, passions, desires, will. You have to be able to distinguish all those. And then when you come to a place and you realize that you are none of these things. I mean, the ultimate you is none of these things. But it's important for you to love this vessel. This vessel, point at yourself, this vessel needs your love and needs your attention before it gives it to anybody because you cannot give what you don't have. You understand? So, and the only way to, to really do that is to exile yourself and be alone. To literally shut off the world and get alone with yourself. Literally nothing. That's what you are. Abundance looks at it like, yo, it's limitless. Poverty looks at, at it like, damn, I ain't shit. It's all perspective. And I hope y'all taking care of yourself. I love you guys. Um, it's that season. So I want to make a video and I want to... Um, you guys to find spaces for yourself make time for yourself preferably out in nature because uh, as an organism an organic an original being from the earth you need that i wish there was no other way but there, there isn't so you need to connect with nature you need to connect with the grid you need to there's no way out of this. This 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 kind of path is um, needs discipline. Things that I'm saying it shouldn't even be a problem for you. And if it's a problem for you, it should show you where you're at. Because um, your higher self needs time alone. 
Your higher self is waiting for you. That archetype you're meant to step into is waiting for you. Waiting for you to grow up. Waiting for you to realize the truth can't be, I can't, I can't speak the truth to you. It can only be realized. You can only have a revelation. I can only lead you to the door. On the way here, I was thinking about uh, Moses. Whether he existed or not, I don't really care. But if you listen, if you look at his story, he was born into royalty, or he wasn't born, he was adopted into royalty. Uh, he had everything you think he would need um, as a man, but his heart, his call in his heart said something different. And it led him to leave where he was and exile himself. Very similar to what I think I did to myself. Went in hermit mode pretty strong out here. And sometimes that's, that's very needed to, to, like I said, to find yourself. Um, anyways, Moses, when he went to the mountain, for whatever reason, I believe the story was because his, his uh, some of his sheep ran away and he had to go get it but on his journey to get his 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 sheep he uh he saw a bush the bush was on fire and it spoke to him long story short it was the i am of the i am and, and he said let my people i need you to lead my people out of egypt i need you to be the ambassador the face and you know what moses said probably said a lot of things but one of the things he said was um I can't speak. I'm not good with speech. And I want to let somebody know that it's okay if you're not good with speech. Take no thought in what you're going to say. Because to think is to be human. There's no good or bad. But sometimes when you're trying to speak from the divine, it has to come from a different place. It has to come from the heart. And that's kind of what I want to talk about today. I want to talk about the heart. The brain is man, the heart is God. Source divine connects to the earth grid itself. And I hope y'all taking time. That's kind of why I make these videos. You know, so make sure you make time for self and make space for yourself. We're five dimensional. We're not limited by nothing no more. I love y'all. If you have any questions, please hit me. 5D, 5D, we take them off, Chosen. Yeah, this one's for you. I love y'all. Right here, Chosen. We taking off 5D beyond. Let's get it. Love y'all. Stay blessed.